Hey everyone, how often should you restake your crow on the DeFi wallet to maximize profits? This is what we're discussing in today's video, including a formula that you can use and possible rates changing in the future. Stick around to learn more. If you're new to the channel, my name is Ben. I've made over six figures trading crypto and I'm on a journey to 10K a month of passive income and I want you to join me on this journey. Let's go. First thing we gotta do is announce the giveaway winners for the 5,000 subs giveaway. Thank you all for commenting and giving me tons of great video ideas for the future. If you're one of the lucky winners, email me with a screenshot of you editing your original comment so I can know that it's you and I'll send you $100 worth of crow. Let's get right to it. Don't worry if you're not a winner today, we'll be doing much more giveaways in the future. All right, here we go. First one. Pete Santi learning to smile. Congratulations, Pete. Send me an email and I'll go ahead and send you over $100 worth of CRO. All right, number two. Abba1972, congrats on 5k subs, Ben. Thanks again for the videos you do. Would you be able to do a video about tax software, like what you do when you're doing tax? Thank you so much. I've seen a lot of your comments on my videos, and yes, I can definitely do a video on that in the future. And just go ahead and email me, and I'll go ahead and send you over that $100 worth of crow. All right, winner number three. So, Swo Hagen. Hey Ben, could you look in the earn feature in the DeFi wallet? Is the guarantee, is the earn a guarantee if you stake then? The percentages seem to change every day. I could definitely do a video on that. I'm actually gonna be talking about a little bit about that in today's video. So go ahead and send me an email and I'll send you over that crow. Winner number four, JJ, thank you. Keep going, VVS. Yeah, I definitely have some future videos for VVS Finance and congratulations. Just send me over an email. All right, and number five, Daryl Paytonod. Thank you so much. Just send me over an email and I'll send you over that $100 worth of crow. All right, that wraps up our giveaway. Thank you so much for everyone for participating. And don't worry, we'll be doing a lot more giveaways in the future. But now on to today's video. So if you're new to Crow or haven't tried out the DeFi wallet, which was like myself for a very long time, I spent my first about nine to 10 months staking any extra crow on crypto earn for about two to six percent staking rewards that was before i actually gave the DeFi wallet a chance because i heard the 20 percent apy and i thought it was too good to be true so by the time i got into it the apy was now at 12 percent but it stayed around there and even gone up a little bit since i started using it about four to five months ago if you want to see how to use the wallet check out my walkthrough of the crypto.com app and i cover the DeFi wallet in that video as well in this video, we're jumping right into the numbers. Thank you, Hockett, for suggesting this idea with me and also sharing the formula and some of the information I'll be covering in this video. Please share your ideas with me down below in the comments because your suggestions are some of my favorite videos to create. So here is the formula right here. It looks like a very complicated calculus formula, so let's break it down. So N is equal to the number of days that you need to restake to maximize the profit. And since it's in numbers of days, if it's less than one, you can just times that number by 24 to get the amount of hours in between each restake. 0.12 is the percentage you would earn, and then 365 days is the days in a year, and that will be used multiple times to figure out the yearly return. And then the small 0.0002 is the transaction fee each time you restake. The link to use this formula will be in the description of this video. All you need to do is change the first number, which is the number of coins. So where it says 1,000. We have this formula. If you stake 1,000 crow, you would earn 1,127.42 crow, or basically 7.42 crow more than you would if you didn't restake at all yourself. And in order to maximize this, you would need to restake your profits every 1.81 days. Now I'm sure you're thinking, well, all of that extra time I spend to restake every two days basically only gets me an additional 7.4 crow. That doesn't seem worth it. Well, that is definitely something to consider if it only takes you about 30 seconds to a minute each time you do this, might as well for the little extra crow. We can do this while we're watching our favorite show. I'm currently re-watching Attack on Titan before I catch up to watch season four, part two, which just came out a few weeks ago. If any of you guys are fans of the show, let me know in the comments. Let's see the difference when we stake 5,000, 10,000, 25,000, 100,000, and 250,000 crow to see how often it says we need to restake and how much extra crawl we would earn. Okay, so first we're gonna do 5,000. So you just need to change this number and then you hit enter. So you would earn a total of 637.3 crow. 
and the 600 is from the 12%, you'd earn an extra 37.3 crow. So you need to restake every 0.81 days, which would be every 19.44 hours. When it comes to these numbers, we aren't going to be perfect and remembering when exactly to restake and everything. So just round up to a day for this one and try your best, but don't worry if you aren't perfect and miss a few days with it. And that goes for all of these examples. All right, next one we're gonna do is 10,000. For 10,000, you would earn 1,274.7 crow. So you would earn an additional 74.7 crow and you would need to restake every 0.57 days which is approximately 13.7 hours. So essentially twice a day for that one. All right, and then we're seeing for 25,000 crow, you would have 28,187 crow. So you'd earn an additional 187 crow from doing this. And to maximize it, you would need to stake every 0.36 days, which is approximately every eight to nine hours. All right, now we're gonna look at 100,000 crow. All right, for 100,000 crow, you would earn an additional 749 crow, and you would need to restake every 0.18 days, or approximately every four to five hours. And our last one is for 250,000 crow. So for 250,000 crow, you would earn an additional 1,873 crow, and you would need to restake every 0.11 days or approximately every two to three hours. So you actually need to be more active with restaking the more crow you hold to maximize the profits. Every three hours is a lot though. Even if it only takes 30 seconds, just remembering to do it all that often would be a hassle. From all these calculations, you can earn about an extra 0.7%, which is really nice and would make a difference long-term, but I'd say do what you can. Like if you can only restake once or twice a day, you'll still, you'll be fine and probably still earn an extra 0.3 to 0.5% rewards. These rates on the DeFi wallet will not remain this high forever. It's currently at 12.45% APR, and from my buddy chatting to validators, those rates won't most likely stay that high. Validators are the people you are staking with and you select a pool. They have a commission they charge for using their pool, and right now most people use the, the ones that are 0% commission. A 0% commission is something that looks like it won't be around much longer because validators want to earn some incentive and they will be voting for a minimum commission of at least 5%, which means that that would take 5% of our 12.45%, and we would be left with 11.83%. But over time, these rates will probably drop down even more into the 9 to 10% range, which is still phenomenal, and you should take advantage now for what we have. Typically, what I've seen with these staking pools, as they increase in price, the more that people want to be staking there, which means more people to split the rewards with, and therefore lower rates. This happens all the time. Like when we saw BBS Finance, it started with over 1000% APR and over a couple months, it's now 176% at the time of this recording. It is due to the increase in people staking in these pools, farms, mines, whatever one you're using. If you found this video helpful, go check out my video on what are the best exchanges to buy crow. Drop a like down below because it'll help push this video out to more people. Thank you so much for watching and remember as always, keep it in the green.